Hi friends, welcome back to our table. Well, <laughs> I have to tell you, I have started to wonder about something. Because sometimes you can actually feel the energy before things happen. And I'm feeling the energy before it happens. Trump's battle with Twitter. Of <laughs> um, the meltdown is happening. Um, that's another thing. People keep asking me if he could be um, pretending, you know, in order to get out of trouble. Anybody can be pretending anything. But this is not pretending. Um, he's really got a problem. Now, I... <laughs> I feel like he's gone. He's, um, this is it, y'all. Well, I have told y'all, he's, he's not going to be around for November. So, we don't even have to worry about that. Um, but this feels like, you got to understand what Trump doesn't understand. The executive order that he signed now forces Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, all of them. It could even affect us, by the way. Um, this is for entertainment purposes only, and it's just my opinion and nothing more. <laughs> um, when he realizes he can no longer tweet the lies. Now, Trump's whole life is based on lies. <laughs> <laughs> so <clears throat> he knows if he puts stuff out there it, if it's not true it doesn't matter if it's bad all the better you know I, this is the way he's looked at things now imagine because <laughs> I'm trying to imagine this imagine how Trump's going to feel when he realizes the thing that he has done, that he has counted on, lying, that he won't be able to do anymore. Now, did Trump realize that? No. No. <laughs> because he can't think right. So, it's up to other people. Now, the administration had to draw that up right and yet they're saying oh no we shouldn't do this it's like all of them have gotten Trump's crazy and none of them seem to be <laughs> so I wanted to um, ask two questions <clears throat> they're both kind of loaded dangerous questions actually um How is Twitter going to affect him now? And is this it for Trump's presidency? And I know it is. I feel it. I feel it. So, you know it is. Um, <laughs> um Really, the question is, is Trump going to leave on his own or is he going to be forced out? And that has always been a 50-50 thing. So, anyway. How is Twitter going to affect Trump after his Oh God, what do you call that? 
just love it when things lead me. Executive order. How, how is Twitter going to, <laughs> to affect Trump after his executive order with Twitter? It, but you know what, y'all? It's not just Twitter. See, that's what people aren't really getting. Yeah, he was mad at Twitter. But Facebook. And let me tell you, there are all kinds of lies on Facebook that Trump keeps putting. Well, they'll have to pull them off. Won't they? <laughs> Unless they want to be sued. We're not talking about Trump being sued. We're talking about the companies being sued. And all because all of a sudden... Something was done that Trump didn't like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these were the things that happened. <laughs> I try to tell people. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. I can't. I can't do that. Mm. Mm. Okay. So this is the sweetheart card. So <clears throat> Facebook, Twitter, really all of them have really been sweet to Donald. Because like I said, he's gotten by with more than anybody. Most people would have their stuff just pulled. You know? <laughs> so they've been really good to him. And um, this is the thought card. Now, this is not even Trump thinking, believe it or not. This is social media now trying to think of how they're going to have to do things differently. Now, the thing I'm getting, and I don't know, y'all, because I honestly don't know. I'm just telling you what I'm getting from the card. So what I'm getting from the card is they know they can fight it, but that can take a while and in the meantime they've got to change <laughs> you know what we could have here how fitting is this what we could have here is social media's hands being tied and having to hold Trump responsible because of Trump's order <laughs> and then when Trump is gone it's just thrown <laughs> Right? Uh, the soldier card. Okay, this is actually about Trump being on the attack and attacking and expects social media to now attack back. So it's kind of like war now. <laughs> um... Who do you think's gonna win that one? <laughs> so this is the the little card, <laughs> and um, this is Trump having to make peace and walk away. I think the answer to my question is Trump is going to realize, you mean I can't lie on social media anymore? You mean I can't put these things out all the time about the, well, how am I supposed to win the election? <laughs> um, and then him getting mad at the people who suggested that he do it in the first place and drew it up because he would expect them to know better. Why? Because he don't. <laughs> and apparently they had a lapse too. Uh, the home card is interesting. So, what I'm getting from this is, when I get the home card, <clears throat> to me it's usually about secrets. Um, it can be about your private property, you know, depending on, on just what you feel or what you get. You know, it can be about a large building that you frequent, you know, go to a lot. So it's kind of like your second home. <laughs> um, 
But generally, it's secrets coming out. Because if you think about a house, you don't see the house, the rooms in the house, until you go in the house. And then you still don't see all of the rooms either. Because, and the room card is the same way. You don't see the rooms. And so sometimes the house can be that way. Um, is what I'm saying. And in this case, I'm seeing the house <clears throat> the same as I see the room card. Which is something hidden. Okay. It may also have something to do with Mar-a-Lago. And I'm really not getting enough on that because, like I said, the house card usually represents your home, a building, <clears throat> something like that. But for whatever reason, I was getting this to be the same as the room card, which is secrets. So, <clears throat> and it feels like to me something's coming out. And I'll bet you it's the Supreme Court. Aren't they supposed to decide something on the 12th of June? So it's probably going to be the Supreme Court coming out with his taxes. Because, see, that's personal. That's, um, that's like home to him. There's something more. Like I said, the house card can re be about different things. And for whatever reason, I'm feeling different things from this card. So... I think I am right. <laughs> it's what we are seeing, y'all, is everything crashing down. It's all crashing down around it. It's falling apart. And no, I don't think he's faking it. I think it's him. I think his... Um, mind isn't in the right place hasn't been in the right place and we've all known it let's just check and see is Trump really sick or is he faking it is Trump really sick or is he faking it is Trump really sick or is he faking it is Trump really sick or is he faking it? I think I'm going to do a longer spread on this one. I keep flipping up and I can't flip these up because then it turns them upside down. So we start off with joyfulness. I think everybody feels, sees, and understands what's going on. I think we can all see the end. And, and we're joyful about that. <clears throat> People are literally praying. People are literally praying that this ends. And that he goes away. <laughs> That's how bad it is. And cheerfulness, when they do, we'll all celebrate. Kind of goes with the joyfulness. The thought. Okay. So there's the thought that we have. We've got to stop letting these things enter our mind, y'all. There's the thought that we have the fear that he won't go away. He's going away. Okay, he's going to be gone. He ain't even going to be there in November. <laughs> and it feels like it's coming. I mean, it's just here. Um, this is the card I wanted to see. This is the doctor card. This is a little bit of sickness and a whole lot of bad news. So everything he's doing is backfiring on him. He is 
sick. Okay. Wow. Okay, so y'all. It's feeling like Trump had a stint put in. He had to have a stint put in. I don't know when that would have been. Or unless it was when he went to Walter Reed. But wouldn't they have kept him overnight or something? I don't know. Um, but I'm getting something was put in to help the flow. The blood flow. And I believe that would be a stint. Maybe there's something else that... But yeah. But I'm also getting... Um, okay. He's going to be surprised. You know, he's not going to be surprised. He's already been surprised. Um... Somebody's already told him. They're like preparing him. Hey, your taxes are coming out. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> the money card. All of the stuff about the hidden money and the secrets. It's all going to come out. But remember the money card is in a room. A room are about secrets. Because you can't see them till you go in them. <laughs> Um, and the old woman is, is the old man. It's Trump. So it's, it's all about him. He has been very fortunate, very lucky all of his life. He has. He's been shown love. He's been given chance after chance after chance. Uh, but this time... When we go back to the same things, he's not going to have that same love and support, and people aren't going to see it the same way. Yeah, it's totally different. <coughs> and they will not see him as a friend. And they will not be a friend to him. The 13th card, they'll be a foe. And they see him as a foe. So all of Trump's luck, love, the reason nobody can figure out why he, all of that is ending. It's coming to an end. And um, no, y'all, I don't think he's faking anything. I think it's Trump. I think what you're seeing and frightening as that is, is the real Trump. I do. I think that's Trump. Um, let's see if I can get an answer to this. Will Trump leave on his own or will he be forced out? Will... Trump leave on his own or will he be forced out? Will Trump leave on his own or will he be forced out? I don't need a big one. Would you stop doing that? leaving did y'all hear me I'm gonna listen to me <laughs> he's leaving um he's consistent he's consistent gifts um this is gonna start coming out too so there's just so much it's and it's all coming out it, it you can't stop it journey 
leaving. <laughs> okay. Um, old new stuff is coming out. Old and new, I'm sorry. Old and new stuff is coming out. And Trump acting like a big old baby. Yeah. And the letter card. The letter is personal. It is directed to you. It's addressed to you. It's for you. Personal. It's coming. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> it's just a matter of time now, friends. It's just a matter. Of, and I don't think it's going to be that long. I really don't. I don't think it is going to be that long at all. I don't. So we just hold on and don't get um, don't get down about anything. We have to stay positive and we have to believe. And uh, Trump does enough damage to himself, y'all. You know. <laughs> and we just have to know and believe that and. That will be done. And that's what we'll do. Okay, so stay positive. Try to stay safe. Try to take care. Until the next time, friends. <laughs>